found more of Lady Sydney's papers, original drafts of El Camino. She made pencil sketches of formations that I recognize in the Valle de las Ranas, and she sketched one of the statues. Lead the way. Okay, okay, so, uh, they had a fantastic creatures carved in rock, uh huh, and she found the statue early one morning, and get this, it was after a rainstorm. And this is another statue of Tlaloc. That is interesting. Let's see if we can find it. El Valle is east of Guanajuato. Mira, let's go. Valle de las Ranas means Valley of the Frogs, though I always thought the stones looked more like fantastical creatures. And Lady Sydney did too. She got sketches in her book. Mira, imagínatelo, imagine it. Explorers like Lady Sydney came all this way with nothing but ganas y un gran amor for the wilds of Mexico. She sounds like someone I know. <laughs> yes. Yo, I shoot cars for the festival. You do all the work. And my ride is a lot faster than her wagons, no? <laughs> we have slightly more than one horsepower. Why no, I suppose reading El Diario is one of the reasons I became una fotógrafa. I wanted to capture the same belleza she did. Today, the Valle de las Ranas is one of the most visited natural wonders in Mexico. Lady Sydney definitely knew a marvel when she saw one. But the guidebooks don't say anything about a Tlaloc statue here. 